Hello everybody. Today is the 22nd of January 2016. The topic today is going to be on worth and welcome to Minutes with PJ. I'm just going to uh, take one area of the Bible today. This is going to be in Luke 18 verses 18 through 27. And basically, um, instead of reading it, I'm going to just tell you the story. There was a leader, he's very rich, and he asked Jesus, Good Master, what can I do to inherit eternal life? And Jesus basically told him, Why do you call me good? None is good but God, who knows the commandments. And then he went over the commandments. Do not commit adultery, do not kill, do not steal, bear false witness, honor your father and mother. And this ruler went ahead and told him that he had kept them, these commandments, since his youth. And Jesus heard all these. He said to him, you only lack one thing. That is to, to sell all your riches, give them to the poor. And then you shall have the treasure in heaven and follow me. When the ruler heard this, he was very sad because he was so rich. And then Jesus saw that he was sorrowful and that said, How hardly shall, they, shall you have those that have riches enter in the kingdom of God? For it is easier for a camel to go through the eye of a needle than for a rich man to enter into the kingdom of God. When everyone heard that, they said, um, then that you can be saved. And he said, the things which are impossible with men are possible with God. So when I, when I went through this story, I thought of it, about it. What is your work today? Do you have a lot of things? Okay. Well, in earth, an earthly way, it might be uh, that you have a lot. A big home, cars, jewelry, money. Okay. But in God's eyes, this is worth nothing. So, how did you get there? Did you lie? Did you cheat? Did you covet? Is this the right way? No, according to the Ten Commandments, you should not covet your neighbor's goods or steal or kill or commit adultery. You should keep those commandments. So now that we've done all that, we say, well, God didn't see it. But guess what? You can't hide from it. Okay, you may think so temporarily, but nothing is hidden from God. So what about salvation? Can you buy it? No, it cannot be bought. It cannot be earned. God gave us the free gift of salvation through his son, Jesus Christ, who ended up dying on that cross to free us from sin. Thank you and have a blessed day today.